Hi friends, welcome to KVR Maths Academy. In this video, let's discuss 7 and 8 problems in exercise 5.2 in quadratic equations of 10th class mathematics. Right? So before doing these problems, friends, please subscribe my YouTube channel, those who are not subscribed yet. Thank you. Yes, let's discuss these problems. Yeah. See, this is the seventh one. The base of a triangle is 4 cm longer than its altitude. If the area of the triangle is 48 square centimeters, then find the base and altitude. Come again. The base of a triangle is 4 centimeters longer than its altitude. Right. If the area of the triangle is 48 square centimeters, then find the base and altitude. So, from this data, first we will write the quadratic equation and after that, we will find the base and altitude, right? Yes, first, suppose simply draw the diagram. A triangle is there. A triangle's altitude is, a triangle is, the base of a triangle is 4 centimeters longer than its altitude. Suppose its altitude is taken as x, then its uh, base is equal to base of a triangle is 4 centimeters longer than its altitude, no? So it will be x plus 4. If it is x units, then it is uh, x plus 4 units. Here, square centimeters has given, no? So let us take like x centimeters and x plus 4 centimeters. Right? Yeah. Solution right now. Let the altitude, altitude, of the triangle altitude of the triangle b x centimeters right now it's a uh, its base is equal to then how much x plus 4 centimeters so area of the area of the triangle what is the area of the triangle a is equal to half bh right Half into base into height, right? Yeah, here half into base how much? Base is equal to x plus 4 into height altitude is x. So that is equal to half into x square plus 4x. Isn't it half into x into x, x square plus 4 into x, 4x. Right? So according to the problem, area of the triangle how much has given? Is 48 square centimeters. Let us equal these both. Yeah. So according to the problem, according to the problem, area of the rectangle, sorry, area of the triangle, triangle is equal to how much? 48 square centimeters. So this is half half into x square plus 4x is equal to 48 so that implies this is x square plus 4x is equal to 2 transferred in this side this will be 48 into 2 so 48 2 is a 96 so that is x square plus 4x minus uh, plus 96 transfer in this side this will be minus 96 this is equal to 0 so now this is a quadratic equation required quadratic equation from this quadratic equation let us find x using factorization method right so so here 96 for 96 we should find the factors to get a plus 4 16 6 96 16 6 not not coming for 12 8 ja? see 12 8 ja? 96 here plus 4 should come now so bigger number plus and smaller number minus here because minus 96 is there 12 minus 8 is plus 4. 12 plus 12 into minus, uh, minus 8, minus 96. Understood clearly? Yes, right, according to that. Yeah, this is x square plus 12x minus 8x minus 96 is equal to 0. In this both, x is the common, so x plus 12. Are you following? Yeah, in this both, what is the common one? Yes, minus 8 is the common x plus 12 also there that is equal to 0 so here again x plus 12 is a common the remaining part is x minus 8 that is equal to 0 so x plus 12 is equal to 0 or x minus 8 is equal to 0 x is equal to minus 12 or x is equal to 8 here length of the base and altitude no there should not be negative 
should not be negative positive values only we have to take right yes here x is equal to uh, x cannot be cannot be negative therefore x is equal to 8 x means here yes altitude altitude is equal to altitude of the triangle is equal to 8 centimeters next its base is equal to base is equal to 8 plus 4 x plus 4 only not 12 centimeters right here if you apply of bh you will get a correct answer c 8 12 is a of base into height now half into base base is 12 and uh, h altitude is 8 not 12 8 ja 96 96 by 2 48 42 only now has given so what we have done is exactly right have you understood clearly about this is note it down next eighth question see two trains leave a railway station at the same time the first train tra travels towards west and the second train towards north the first train travels five kilometers per hour faster than the second train if the uh, if after two hours they are 50 kilometers apart find the average speed of each train understood clearly some see come again two trains leave a railway station at the same time suppose two trains are there suppose a railway station here is there two trains leave the railway station at the same time right the first train travels towards west first train travels towards west suppose this is east this is west this is north this is south now so first train travels towards west right next uh, and second train travels towards north second train travels towards north right see this is west and this is north right the first train travels 5 kilometers per hour faster than the second train suppose here the second train speed is x kilometers hour per hour let us take then this will be first train speed will be how much 5 kilometers per hour faster than the first train now so this is x plus 5 kilometers per hour right next after two hours if after two hours they are 50 kilometers apart so 50 kilometers means yes these two trains here this is the first train and this is the second train now so this is the distance between these two trains is after two hours 50 kilometers right so we have to find the average speed of each train average speed of each train so first with using this data we have to find the quadratic equation after that we have to find the speed of each train understood so what has given first that only write down yes solution let the speed of second train second train or uh, slower train slower train b x kilometers per hour slower train why i have taken here say so first train is x plus 5 kilometers per hour so 5 kilometers faster than the first uh, second one no that's why slower train b x kilometers per hour next uh, well the speed of the speed of the faster train faster train is equal to how much then is x plus 5 kilometers per hour next uh, here after two hours time time how much has given time t is equal to yes how much two hours two hours next uh, the distance between these two trains the distance between these two trains is equal to how much 5 50 kilometers after two hours right so no need to write that one first uh, let us find uh, here x quadratic equation x x plus 5 so here we know very well what is that speed 
speed is equal to here so speed of the first train is x slower train speed of the faster train is x plus 5 so how much distance it has uh, taken in two hours it has traveled in two hours let us uh, find distance distance traveled traveled by the slower train slower train in two hours in two hours is equal to how much actually distance is equal to speed into time only now so speed how much x into 2 that is equal to 2x right next uh, distance distance traveled by the faster train faster train in two hours two hours is equal to faster train is x plus 5 into 2 that is equal to 2x plus 10 right this is actual distance means here this is 2x plus 10 this is 2x so if you see this you observe carefully this is the right angle triangle in a right angle triangle by Pythagoras theorem the square of hypotenuse is equal to sum of the squares of other two sides right so this is the hypotenuse and these are the remaining two sides right so by Pythagoras principle see 2x whole square plus 2x plus 10 whole square is equal to 50 square right this is 4x square plus this is 2x whole square means 4x square plus 2ab 2 2 is a 4 4x into 10 40x plus 10 square means yes 100 is equal to 2500 right so 4x square plus 4x square 8x square plus 40x so if you transfer this one minus 2500 plus 100 yes how much minus 2400 right so i'll do here this is is equal to zero we have to keep why because it transferred to this sign no so in these three terms which table get cancelled yes eighth table eight how many times in eight x square one time so this will be x square plus eight five is a 40 only no? plus five x eight how many times eight three is a 24 300 times so minus 300 is equal to zero right yeah so we the factors of 300 factors of 300 to get 5 this is 20 15 is a 300 only here positive and here negative so this will be minus no here plus 5 means plus 20 minus 15 right this is x square plus 20x minus 15x minus 300 is equal to 0 so yeah, if you do common as x x plus 20 minus 15 x plus 20 is equal to 0 again x plus 20 if you write as common the remaining part is x minus 15 is equal to 0 so x is equal to minus 20 or x is equal to 15 here this x means what we have taken speed speed should not be negative right x x cannot be negative therefore speed speed of the slower train slower train is equal to how much 15 kilometers per hour and the speed of the faster train faster train is equal to how much 15 plus 5 x plus 5 only la. 15 plus 5 that is equal to 20 kilometers per hour have you understood clearly yes note it down okay friends if you like my video please like and share don't forget to subscribe thank you thank you very much